Gonna start at the table, same thing. This time his butt's gonna be on his heels. All right, it's a Kimura sit up. All right, so I'm sitting up, starting to attack that Kimura like we did last week. Try to point your toes behind you. Yep, so person on your knees, try to point the toes, get your butt as low as possible, knees wide, right? So he's got a good strong base. I can't move him around. Right, so his hands are on the ground. I'm gonna pick one arm, I'm gonna shoot over the opposite shoulder. As I do that, I'm gonna pop up on my other hand, and whatever arm I'm reaching it with, that foot is gonna to go to the ground. So I'm gonna come up onto his shoulder here, right? I'm gonna curl my bent leg, so the one that's still up in the air, I'm gonna curl that to lift my hips up. Then I drop back down, right? Switch sides, popping up to the hand. I curl that leg to lift my hips up a little bit, and then back down. All right, so each time I go back to guard, but I'm using that momentum of my shoulders to switch sides and pop up. Touch my feet, pop up to the other side. My hips are in his lap. The only thing on the ground is my outside foot and my hand. All right, my armpit is on his shoulder just to make it as sneaky as possible, right? And I'm biting down with that elbow. So if Colin was to sit back right now, right, so sit back, yep, I'm gonna come with him. You see, in case he tries to fight him. Then I come back. Yes? Questions? All right, we talked about this, I think it was sometime last week, right? Where I can pop up, I can attack my Kimura sweep, or I can attack the arm lock, depending on the attack, right? But I gotta be able to get up on my hand here, right? If I'm just up on my elbow and I try to twist, this is a great way to dislocate ribs. Trust me, I've done the research, okay? And then you end up with these little pointy things in your ribs. That means you'll never have abs again in your life. Really? Right? Questions? One, two, three.